Heard it from a friend, she was in her bed, should've known better Said it was the truth, she came on to you, yeah but you let her Knocked me over ten feet forward Never knew Hello, hello! Welcome back to this channel, of course you know what we do, it's good vibes You're going to the beach, what beach? The water Hmm so today we are vlogging vlogging has started again as usual i'm sure by now is or i don't disturb my my video i just the internet now okay if you want to watch cartoon watch cartoon and stop disturbing me so today we are running errands we are going to the city center as i was saying earlier um, I'm sure by now you guys have already watched the pregnancy announcement and we can pick up from there Okay, so vlogging is going to continue either weekly or every two weeks depending on how How I feel how strong I feel. Okay, so yeah, we're going for errands today We have quite a lot of things to do. We're going to Primark. We want to return some things We're also going to now I can start shopping for baby actually you know i'm ready to start shopping for baby very very ready and i'll just start picking things small 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 here and there here and there before i go for like before we go for the major 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 shopping okay um what else what else are we doing today returning stuff i need to buy a red bell pepper you guys know i don't i don't know i prefer like the organic ones there's these guys i buy from at swansea market once the immediate as soon as you enter swansea market they are by your right the first stall i always buy like boxes from them i'm going to check them again today and buy it and see if they have so i can buy the box because i always cook with rebel pepper like that's if you're in nigeria you know those big tatashi pepper it's very important to me anyway so i'm checking that out today as well and just picking one or two things that we need and i think that's just about it we're also going to the playground we are, we are going to be outside today <laughs> yesterday we, we wanted to be outside we wanted to go out because my husband is on holiday and i am not working as well right now i've had like a few days off work so we have time to actually do anything and give Ore like our son give him quality time with us and all but yesterday was raining the weather was uh yesterday it wasn't even nice we couldn't step up but today is sunny it looks more happy today you know spring is coming no spring is here now Abby. spring starts in march i think the ending of march or the beginning of april i'm not so sure but this is the ending of march and spring is here so the sun is getting better you know everywhere is looking more happy just that we have some days where it's rainy, 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 and some days it's sunny, sunny, sunny. So come with us, guys. Let's go out today. I'm really, really excited. Whew, the chick is chicken. The nose is nosing. Ha, <laughs> ah, Lord. Okay, okay. Very soon. Very, very soon. The fine guy is going to come back. But for now, you guys are going to take this mommy, this mommy look, okay? I'll see you later. Bye. My men. <laughs> yeah, so we're off to Primark now. We usually park our car in Tesco. But the thing with parking in Tesco is if you park for more than one hour, they give you two hours free parking. But one hour is what you really, really get for free, for free, for free. If you park more than one hour, you have to go into Tesco to buy something worth three pounds. Three pounds and above, then they will give you like the parking ticket then you when you're coming out of tesco you have to validate that ticket and that's how you are free but i actually feel it makes sense because there's a parking um lot just opposite tesco where you can park for one hour one pounds two hours two pounds three hours three pounds four hours four pounds 24 hours five pounds yeah I'm, I'm looking at it as i'm calling it but i believe that if you park in tesco for more than one hour and you have to buy something worth three pounds to, like to not pay anything for the parking i feel like it makes more sense but i'm buying something for three pounds i'm getting value for that three pounds you understand what i mean i'll use i can use that three pounds to buy like let me say rice or egg or something that i'll be seeing in my house that is of value to me than just paying for a parking space where all i get is the parking space 
do you do you catch my drift so i like to pack in tesco even if i exceed the one hour all i have to do is buy something worth three pounds and i'm free for the time i pack you know it makes sense that way so yeah we are off to primark first now and i'm gonna take you guys along yeah so we got into primark this day we needed to return some items and we ended up buying things that hmm, facts things that we didn't that's just the thing anytime you get into a store you just want to buy something especially this primark now so we go to this baby clothes section and i was just looking at all the neutrals and i'm like look at this cute cute neutral clothes they're so pretty the colors the new the yellows the whites oh they are so pretty and i was tempted to shop but i did not shop that day i just kept pushing it forward and i like i, I kept going to the other side it's like the baby girl section there's the baby boys section as well i think primark has a range of like really nice clothes especially for newborns for newborn babies you don't want to like spend so much like buying clothes for them because most times they'll be in like onesies and like you know they're not going to be wearing like serious serious clothes you know you can just buy some clothes for them just for outings but not too serious until they start to grow or they start to walk and crawl you know so i really don't mind shopping from primark i'll be doing a lot of shopping from primark um also from george also from um there are so many brands in the uk like the uk is the home of clothes the uk is the home of shoes the uk is the home of anything that's like anything fashion anything clothing that you need so i really don't have any problem when it comes to clothing and all i'm also looking at buying baby buggy that thing that they use um that's it's not a buggy really but that thing they push babies with and we needed to buy a new shoe for Ore as they are resuming school again they had a two-week holiday so i said before the two week is ready i'm going to buy him a new shoe we bought him that spider-man shoe and as we're going we saw that it's already a steal we don't steal anything primark is cheap stop stealing <laughs> i had to do a video that if you are if, if you ever go to primark and you take what and you steal anything then you don't have a conscience because primark is not the most expensive store look at this really nice bag now i think it's just nine pounds very pretty mini bag it's just nine pounds it's just nine pounds you know but it's sad that some people still actually go in and they steal things um that's just a warning it's, it's a steal already there's no point stop stealing it's not good <laughs> Look at these nice bags this one is like a beaded bag this bag is so pretty it's like 16 quid yeah and it has the white version as well i don't i didn't really like the white version so i i think i preferred the black if i was gonna buy this bag but i don't know i don't like bags like this not bad but i like executive bags most times mini bags i have a couple of mini bags but i like executive bags this bag is pretty it's giving like the tote bag you know that tote bag by mac jacobs but like the you know the primark version <laughs> the budget version of the tote bag that's what it's giving and it's really really nice i mean i don't mind carrying a bag like that especially when it's just like a leisure day a picnic day a park day it's really not bad so we just did um lots and lots of window shopping i saw these bags as well it's so this one too is so nice like the quality of what you see and the price is is really good i mean the prices have really come up compared to how much they were like last year or last two years but i mean it's still better than it's the price still matches the quality if you get what i mean so we wear this was also on our way home going to the park like i said earlier after primark we, we planned to go to the park and this is when we got to the park and i started to talk from here i guess like we literally just got here and to our amazement people are so many like ah i understand anyway they are on two weeks holiday right now and so parents are trying to take their kids out or more because you can't be at home they need to expel energy the energy is too much <laughs> some people are just ah. there's no place to even sit my leg is aching man i need to sit down somewhere there's no space to sit you know even i don't look i'm wearing a big clothes i don't look like i'm pregnant and i need to sit down oh my god <laughs> Yeah, so after here, the next place to go to is the beds. Last time we came, my new friend, Dara, she took us to, like, there's another part of this park that's on the other side where you can buy bed food and feed. I think the bed food is 50p. 
and feed the birds you know they're going to come around you feed them it's so pretty and so oh in boyish <laughs> you know like because are you feeding the birds <laughs> you will buy the food with your with your money and feed the birds cute i know really likes it we did it the last time and we're going to do it again today after here just so he's happy because i already promised him we are coming because left to me i'll just go back home and go and sleep more at least let me spend time with him now that he's on holiday yeah <laughs> he's so happy all right so i've left them jail i beg i've left them in the playground both of them because Ori has to be supervised that boy has energy some energy that hey but i'll just i'm just here sitting down under this tree and they're right over there i'm not going to switch off switch over the camera this is like the water bottle i drink water with now it's massive is it two 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 thousand liter sorry oh sorry two thousand milliliter two thousand milliliter bottle so that's like two liters of water this is what i drink every day i try to drink one at least a full one every day i don't like drinking water trust me if not for pregnancy like i'm trying to like drink water do the right things i hate water water is not sweet i only drink water because i'm maybe after eating so it's not going to choke me i don't drink water because i want to drink water i don't like water and i was my 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 colleagues were saying i can put squash in it but i'm like i don't think squash is safe or it's healthy not like it's, it's not safe but i don't think it's healthy to be drinking squash every day you know but i just force myself you do anything for your child at the end of the day <laughs> so i'm trying my best i'm being a good mother by drinking at least this full water bottle every day and i even eat, when i go to work i'm able to drink more because you know i'm at work i'm sitting down after working a bit i pick it up drink i pick it up drink i pick it up drink it's easier for me to drink a lot at work than at home when i'm at home i don't want to like put the water in this water bottle i just go straight and take water and drink i don't drink well at home so i'm trying my best to do to do better to drink water so that everything is gonna be perfectly perfectly fine i remember the first day i went for my scan the first first scan i did at 12 weeks when they like the first scan you're ever going to do with nhs is at 12 weeks when i did the first scan they were trying to take my blood and they couldn't find my veins the woman was like ah, i can't find your veins your veins are hiding don't you drink water i said i tried to drink water but she's like no i i don't drink water because if i drink a lot of water my vein will not be difficult to find so since then i decided to start drinking water so because she had to like trick me she took me in this hand in my she took me in, like four she, she no <laughs> i'm speaking nigerian english i said trick she pricked me in like four different places before she was able to find a steady vein to give her enough blood that she needs to test and all that so I, I since that day i just said okay okay i'll be responsible i'll start drinking water so don't be like me please drink water drink water water is important water is necessary for human living okay thank god i even use sunscreen today because the sun outside today is not laughing and i wish i even brought it with me so i can reapply but we move we what we move i hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far mm, it's not really a long long vlog but i'll try to put like at least maybe two days content it might, it might just be today but whatever i'm able to put together i definitely will and yeah thank you guys for the congratulatory messages i see them all i see them all you guys hey <laughs> gosh i'm so thankful thank you guys thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you okay i'll see you in my next clip after a few seconds my men came to look for me the big man and the small man <laughs> They came after I left them. They said going to be playing, but I didn't take club before. Red dragged his father again back, back to the playground. Like when we come to the playground, his father has to do so much work. Like you have to look at what my husband is doing now, trying to help him move the thing so that he can have fun and all that. But then it's it's nice. At least you get to engage. You meet other kids. You you socialize and all that good stuff i remember the first time he brought Ore, he didn't want to leave but now he is now like used to it i think then he, he just came from nigeria so it was so much fun for him like oh my gosh you know uh, it's playground it's this i want to play i want to that but now that he knows that he's always at his beck and call we can always come there anytime he likes he knows that okay even if we are leaving now we are going to come back it's not like a forever to look at my husband he's laboring <laughs> oh my gosh see a eh, parenthood is not for kids though hmm. before you think of having kids or like starting a family 
you are going to sacrifice a lot you're going to sacrifice yourself but it's one of the most beautiful things you'd ever do you are going to be sacrificing a lot your life is not yours anymore you are going to start sharing be like huge huge parts of your life which is a very um it's it's a privilege you know i do that i don't i don't take for granted so we came to this um this parts like after the park anytime we come we always come to like feed the swans these are swans this is the reason like they call this place swansea because we have a lot of swans so these are swans in the water the swans are there and the birds as well so you you buy there's a shop where you can buy food for them and actually feed them that's the food you see already feeding them so we buy the food is 50p per pack and already is just going to throw it in there for the swans or he's going to throw it for the birds he enjoys doing it and i just enjoy seeing that <laughs> Yeah, uh -huh. look at they're happy now. They're all eating now. Feed them. But no bears there. Oh, it's going there. Yeah. See, they're all coming to you. Good. Feed them. Gently, gently. Don't don't finish it at once. Bow. Yeah, baby like rainbow. Look. Look at the rainbow. Yeah, it's so pretty.